Okay, in this question, we're going to be revolving this line x equals 1 around the y-axis. So we'll get this cylinder. And then we're going to subtract this bowl out of the top of it. We're going to revolve this uh, curve x squared plus 1 around the y-axis as well. And so we'll cut that out of the top of our cylinder. In the end, this is what it should look like, if you can tell. You can see here that there's a cylinder and uh, there's basically a bowl cut out of the top of it. Okay, so let's get started. So this is going to be made up of, uh, well, what I'll do is I'll take the integral of the big one. I think that's what I'll do first. So I'm just going to revolve 1 around the y-axis. So that will be from 0 to 2. When that equals, plug in 1, that's 2. So that's 0 to 2. Remember, it has to be along the y-axis if I'm revolving or taking area around the y-axis of 1 dy. So that will be that piece. And then I'm going to subtract this piece revolved. And that should be from 1 to 2 of, and this one we don't know yet. That's going to be uh, solve for x. Remember, you have to do that always. y minus 1 equals x squared. So that's going to be root y squared minus 1 squared. And I need a pi here. I need a pi there. It's pi r squared, pi r squared, dy. So again, this is the cylinder, radius 1. So pi r squared, this is revolved around the y-axis. And I'm going to cut this piece out by revolving the root y minus 1 around the y-axis. OK, so this one, we have, uh, will just be y, pi y from 0 to 2, which will equal 2 pi. And then we'll have, uh, pi integrals it's from 1 to 2 of y minus 1 dy, which is equal to pi pi of 1 half y squared minus y from 1 to 2. Substitute in 2, that's pi times 4 over 2 is 2 minus 2 minus pi times 1, so that's 1 half minus 1. So that's 0, that goes away. This stays, so it's minus and this thing, which is negative pi a half minus 1 is minus a half. Okay, so let's simplify this a little bit. I'll go in green because this is now our answer. So this is our answer. Simplifying it, we have 2 pi minus, looks like pi over 2, which is 3 pi over 2. So let's recap here. Uh, if you're not quite getting it, I'm revolving 1 around the y-axis. That's pi r squared from 0 to 2. That's that piece. That answer is right here. Okay, makes sense, 2 pi. And then I carve out this piece here. I revolve this one and subtract it. So that work is here. And then I subtracted it right there, and my final answer is there.